Hi everyone. Um, today, um, I'm a little late in the game, but um, I have some Sephora haul and also a couple items from uh, Macy's. Um, I was able to um, grab the VIB um, discount, which is 15% off, um, which is good. Um, it's better than nothing. So um, I finally gathered, um, had time to gather all my stuff and then I want to share them with you. So I'm going to go ahead and grab the first box, um, this one. Um, so as usual, they usually um, give you like um, freebies to try on. Um, this is from NARS Bronzing Powder. Um, don't usually use a lot of bronzing. You got some Clinique um, foundation. Um, so this year I didn't buy a lot of um, big ticket items. Um, this year, because it's been a couple of years, my daughter and I um, started um, doing the, um, what is it, advent calendars, which we enjoy very much. Um, my husband, not so much. Um, there's not a lot of advent calendars for men. Um, I did get him a couple of things a couple of years ago, but he wasn't really into it. So I came up with an idea. Um, I already bought like three advent calendars, one for me and two for my daughters. I bought the Charlotte Tilbury advent calendars, um, so I'm excited to open that one. And then two for my daughter. I think I got her one from Macy's and one from Sephora, I'm not sure. Um, so can't wait to open those. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to share you, they're not, not all of them are um, full size. So a lot of them could be like, you know, minis or something. So what I plan on doing is I got this from Amazon. I was gonna create my own advent calendars for my daughter, something that she can actually use and um, that she can use every day or something like that. So I got this one, which has the numbers and the wooden um, clip and some, uh, I'm not sure what this calls, I'm kind of tying down, so that's that. And then I got this one also, which has um, different kind of um, Christmas theme, I guess. So there should be um, 24 in each, yeah, 24. So, and then what I'm gonna do is, um, perhaps buy some sort of a pegboard and then just kind of pin them and then and that'll be their, um, my makeshift um, advent calendars for them. So that should be exciting. So I'm gonna go ahead and share with you what I got from Sephora to try to put some of, um, some of mine and some I'm gonna put in her um, advent uh, bags. So this one, um, it's called Wild Wishes. Um, I think these are, um, multi, I'm not sure if this is powder or blushes, I'm not sure, but they look like blushes. I don't want to open it yet, but it looks like that. There's three different, um, some of them are, I picked up from the sale, um, the sale ones. So, multi something can't read it because it's like the letters are blending in um in the box but anyway yeah it looked um interesting so multi-use powders so that's what it says right there so uh, we'll try that one so i think this is mine and then i got a majority of the little uh, minis oh well they're not so minis um, I grabbed them from the sale, um, bucket, whatever you call it. So this one, it's going to go on her, um, calendar. So I'm going to use that one. This is just a regular, uh, face mask, which she enjoys, um, using. So, um, that's why I wanted to get something that she could actually use. And then I got this one, 
um, for her. I think this was the, um, in the mini sales. So she's not really into makeup, but maybe um, lipstick here and there, you know. Um, so this is um, this was nineteen dollars, of course, with the fifteen percent off. Um, so that was the, this is I think it's called Laneige um, Lip Daydream. That's what it's called because I have I still have mine from last year the big one which I love very much is actually moisturizes your lips which is pretty good so that's that so I'm not sure if I'm gonna separate the two or whatever I'll figure it out so and I also got this one this is a sleep mask cooling clay eyes eye mask yeah so she likes that sometimes she has a hard time um, sleeping and you know so maybe this will help her. Excuse my nail, my nail polish are peeling off. So that's that. And then I also got her, no, actually this is mine because she doesn't do her eyebrows. So just like a mini eyebrow from Benefit, which I love. So I'm gonna try that one. So, and then yeah, this is actually mine. This is the Anastasia. The brow pomade, which I enjoy very much. Um, I had one, but I don't know what I did with it. So, because we did move um, to our home about eight months ago and don't know what happened to it. So I went ahead and grabbed another one with the, of course, with the discount helps. And then I got this one. It's a mini Frosted Wishes brush set. Um, it was pretty cheap, so not really a um, makeup person, but I'm sure I'll be able to use it with something. And then, of course, they always give you goodies. Um, this is the YSL perfume. I don't own. I'm very picky with my perfume, so I usually stick to the one I enjoy the most. But once in a while, I like to try uh, different brands. So that's that. And this one, I think this is a preview with your points. It's the Tatcha, the Dewy Skin Cream. So, yeah, I'm excited to try this one. So, I've been trying to, um, I don't know, it's not really um, a process, but I've been trying to do some sort of skincare um, for myself um, because we are home. And by the way, I am not working from home. Um, it's good for me. I love it. Um, I don't have to deal with traffic. I don't have to deal with, you know, rushing around and, and, you know, so I love working from home. So that's why I haven't been, I wasn't able to make videos for a couple of weeks. Um, and, you know, my daughter got sick and then just busy trying to move everything here and trying to make my own office. So that's that and just, holidays coming up you know so we're just busy so yeah this is the Tatcha skin cream so I'm gonna try this one um and then I got this miniature palette um to be honest with you I'm not really an eyeshadow person but you know what for the price I think I don't know if it was like eight dollars or something i don't even know how to open this thing but anyway it's the miniature palette by sephora and it's got like those colors right there you know so i'm interested in using it six eyeshadow palette so that's the one and that's that because i don't want i don't want the video to be too long so i got a couple a few of um of, um, what is this? This is for the eyes um, that I got for to put in her uh, advent calendar. I'm gonna put this for her. So, yeah, this is by Sephora. So she's uh, really into that stuff, you know. And let's see, this one, I'm not sure if this is a freebie or the miniature one. This is be best 
of a rare beauty. I wanted to try the lipstick and see how it is. Oh, is this by Selena, I think? I'm not sure. But anyway, so yeah, I'm curious to try this color um, for the fall. I don't want to try opening it because something, you know, I have a problem opening things and then I wind up tearing it out. Oh, there it is. Got it. I'm not sure if it's just a lipstick or there's two in there. Okay. We got. Oh, that's cute. So, this is how it comes. And it's. I like that. It's like a bronzy brown, and I think you have this little gloss that comes with it. So. And it's called Bliss. Hmm, interesting. So anyway, yeah. I don't wear a lot of makeup, but I do love to try new lip products. So that's the one from, I don't know how much this is. I'm sure it wasn't very expensive. So, shoot. Um... Yeah, this is uh, Best of Rare Beauty. There you go. So that's that. And then, I think this is a freebie. Not sure, but it's the Dior. I've heard so much good things about this uh, mascara from Dior. Um, don't really have a lot of, um, why is this, I look so bronzy. Um, I don't, have a lot of eyelashes but um, I have I use um, I think it was a Maybelline that has a primer and um, I think I mentioned that on my <coughs> one of my, my one of my videos but um, that's the one that actually works for me because I have a oily eyelid and and it's waterproof I mean for me I have to use waterproof or otherwise it's not gonna work but um, I'll try it and see if it works for me. If not, I'm sure my daughter's going to use it. So that's that. The Dior Mascara. I'm not sure what the name of it is. But anyway. And then I think this is a freebie. It's a perfume from Dior. I don't know, own anything from Dior, I don't think. Oh, that's cute. There you go. It's a little perfume bottle. Let's see. Hmm. Not too strong. There you go. Oh, that's cute. So that's that. I think this is a free uh, points. And then got this one. I think this is also points. Um, this is from Josie Moran. It's a whipped argan oil base uh, butter. So. I'm gonna try that one. I'm, I don't have anything. Oh, I think it's sealed. I don't want to open it yet. Um, I'm not gonna use it. Just try to preserve it as long as you can. I don't want to waste it. And then, what is this? Dry bar? Did I get this one? I don't remember picking this out. But anyway, this was a dry shampoo um, from Dry Bar. There you go. So that's that from this box. I might, I might put this on my daughter's um, advent calendar. That should be interesting. So yeah, I love getting this little miniature things, you know. And if you're not sure about something, you can always try it out in a small version. So here's another box. Sephora, you need to stop using so much paper. So, that's my receipt. So, this one, I think this is a, a freebie. This is from Fenty Beauty. I don't have anything from Fenty Beauty, but I'm, I, at least they gave you enough foundation to try on. Not like this, you know, little swipe. It's called Fenty Beauty by Rihanna Pro Filter. Hmm, interesting. So those are the shades. So 
I'm sure I'll be trying that out. And then I got another freebie of oh, points. I'm what am I saying free for? This is from Tom Ford. Um, Eau de Soleil Blanc. Don't know what this smells like. So that's why I love getting those samples because right now not a lot of people are shopping in the store so you don't know what things smells like for few especially so it's nice to have like freebies so you can try it out and see if you like it so but i'm sure even if i like this one i probably won't be able to uh i'm not gonna buy the bottle because i heard they're very expensive i don't know so that's that and then got this one i think this was the miniature from clinique I smell somebody from work before. I'm not sure. She said she's uh, using Clinique, but she didn't want to tell me which one it is. So um, I think this has three different. Um, it's Clinique Happy. Are they all the same? Oh no, Clinique Happy, Clinique um, Heart, Clinique Bloom. So I'm curious to smell them because I like more of fruity, fresh, you know, smell. Um, I'll show you what I got from um, Macy's because that's where I usually buy my perfumes because they come in the gift sets, um, which I like to um, get my perfume and gift sets. So that way you have extras. Who doesn't want extras, right? So that's that's at the Clinique. I think this is a spray to spray on what does it say it doesn't say rollerball oh yeah it's perfume spray it's a spray so that's good um i've got another samples from dolce and gabbana light blue i used to use this a long long time ago and then you just, you just smell everybody you i'm just like no if everybody's using it then i don't want it so i think this is another points from a uh, lineage um this one is a water sleeping mask um is it actually for your lips or for your face I'm not sure sleeping care well anyway that's that and then got this i like this one i i i got this um a while back i think maybe Last year or year before, I got the same thing, tin can, which you get, um, you get three brow products. There you go. Um, and that's the only time I bought, I only, the only time I buy it is when they go on sale, so. And then you get to use your uh, discount, which is good. It's called the Great Brow Basics. So that's that, this is mine. So anyway, so that's that for this box. And then, whoops, um, another box. <clears throat> I went ahead and got this Shiseido uh, facial cotton, um, cotton pads. So I wanna try this out and um, Everybody seems to like it, so you know how we get sucked in into buying things that everybody recommends. So I'm gonna try this one. So Sephora, too much paper. Anyway, so I got this one, and this I think it's only twelve dollars, which is not bad. It, it's called Tropical Set, and it comes with its own. Um, cosmetic bag which is nice you can't have enough cosmetic bags right why can't i open this thing oh they locked it but anyway um it's got five different um face mask it says five mask visage i don't know what that means but it says yeah so I think what I'm gonna do is also put this in her advent calendars. And she's gonna enjoy all the space mask. So, and then I got this one. I think this was $10, this one. Um, skincare surprise. 
four skincare products. All right. I don't remember why I grabbed this, but I don't usually, um, I don't usually buy things like this. But anyway, Wild Wishes. I wish it tells you what's in it. I know it says four skincare products. Oh, there it is. I think more face mask. I'm not sure. But anyway, I'm sure this will be going to my daughter's uh, calendar. And I went ahead and bought... This one seemed to have a good reviews. It's the Urban Decay on the Run. There you go. It's a eyeshadow palette. I think I'm having a thing with eyeshadows now. You know, maybe I'll learn how to put them on. I have a little bit of a bronzer in my eyes. Ooh, look at that. Pretty. I don't know about the blue one there, bluish green one though, but very nice. I'm not gonna swatch it because I don't wanna touch it yet. Um, I don't wanna touch anything that I'm not gonna use. So that's the, I don't know how much this was. It doesn't have a price. So, it's called Detour. On the Run, Urban Decay. Very nice. And, and I went ahead and bought this one. I think this was $48. And I like what's in it. So, that's also going to go in, in her advent calendar. So, because I need to fill out four, 24 bags. So, and this one has the NARS uh, Kat Von D um eyeliner and also another anastasia brow which will go to me and then um urban decay all nighters smashbox photo finish and then what is this huda beauty um lipstick i don't know if she wants that one and then the mark jacobs uh, mascara and some sort of p and what is that blush some sort of Too faced um either a blush or a bronzer i'm not sure so yeah there you go i'm not gonna go ahead and open it or is it oh it's a drawer maybe oh they sealed it so anyway that's what's in that this is the sephora favorites there you go and i believe they're all i'm not sure if they're all full size though but anyway that's still pretty good um so that's that. And I got the Tardius. I think this is for my daughter. She requested this one. She likes to make her uh, wing eye, eye wing, or whatever. So this is the Tarte. Um, what is it called? Paint liner. Day paint liner. There you go. And then I also got her um, pencil sharpener from NARS. So that's going to go in her habit. So I have the three um, skincare that I wanted to try. I have one already. I think I bought the peeling one. Um, so this is from Ordinary. They're not that expensive. And... The reviews are amazing so I went ahead and try it without spending too much money so this is from the ordinary brand um, you can only get it online at Sephora this is a glycolic acid a toning solution so I want to try that one and this one is the vitamin C uh, suspensions 23% with HA spheres 2% so I want to try that one as well um, and then the last one is the lactic acid 10% plus HA. So I want to try this product and see how um, it works on my skin. Um, I don't have a lot of skin issues, but I have a, co I have a couple of um, age spots, for, I guess from the sun. I don't know. Uh, I'm not really a sun worshiper. So, and I do have um, large pores around my nose. So... You know, anything like that but i don't really have a lot of skin issues aside those and i do have oily skin 
So can't wait to try this uh, skin products. So two more items and then we're done. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this away. So I'm gonna reveal to you my two favorite, all time favorite perfumes, which I only get at Macy's. So, Tory Burch, the original. I mean, it used to be um, orange, but they changed it to green. So, see how you get the regular side, the big size, and then you also get uh, a little, it's not too little, actually, there's a uh, pretty good size of this stuff. See, pretty good size, it's not, Oh my God, I love this smell. It never gets old. Yeah, you just smell so expensive without killing uh, killing anybody beside you or whatever. It's very sexy and um, not too fruity. So, yeah. And then, the other one, this was my first love um, when it comes to perfume. This has been around for a long time, which is from DK, <laughs> DKNY Be Delicious. So this one you smell like, you see how I like shopping at Macy's? This is the only place where you can buy where you get extra. You get the big bottle, you get the little bottle, and also you get the um, refreshing shower mousse. Oh, interesting. So haven't tried that one, but there you go. This one, this brings brings oh, brings back the memories. I swear. Why is it so hard to get out? There you go. This is a spray bottle. Oh my god. Actually, I'm gonna put it on now. Oh. Yeah, even though this is more a summer perfume, I don't care. I wear it anytime I want. So those are the two of my favorites, the DKNY uh, Be Delicious and the Tory Burch Original. Um, yeah, so I think, I'm not sure how much this costs. It doesn't say, uh, oh, this is 134. Um, for the set and then this one is a hundred dollars for the set which is not bad so and then you also get freebies from Macy's I got Versace let me smell that one then you get Valentino and some extra one for men and Clinique extra foundation so that's that. So anyway, um, I wish I had the pegboards. Not a pegboards. Um, it's a cork board um, where I'm going to be using to put um, the little bags for the advent um, calendars for my husband. I'll get him like little tools. He's not into luxury. He's not into fashion or anything like that. He's very simple. But his tools and his fat bikes, I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with fat bikes he has three and one is on the way so he usually builds his own fat bikes so that alone is you know costs more than all my um bags and whatnot so but anyway that's his passion which is okay so what i'm gonna do with his advent calendar um bags is um i'm gonna put like little things that he might need for himself or for his garage. I don't know, anything small that will fit. Um, but they're not, they're not very big. So I, this is the biggest one I could find. Um, so there you go. And they come in different colors. So what I'm gonna do is wrap them up. You know, let's say like the sharpener, I'm gonna wrap it up in a, uh, paper and then I'm just gonna put it in cinch it and then pin it to the to the cork board with the date so that way they can follow which date they're gonna open so that should be fun so 
So I hope I can find enough small things for for him that I can put in it. Uh, put in it. So anyway, that's all I have for now. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel, please do so. I would appreciate it very much. And then um, see if you like this video. All right. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.